We're here for the sunrise. But it's overcast because it's 6.34 when it's supposed to rise. I mean, that might just be when it like first peaks out. Well, at least the sky's still kind of pretty. It is. Only for Of course it's going to rise. We just mean you're not sure if we're going to get a good video of it. I think it's going right behind that bank of clouds right there. Yeah. So you're not going to see the sun until it gets up past there. And by that point, it's not going to look all pretty. Yeah. We're still here, but it's okay. It's not our fault. It's not yeah. yeah, we still did a sunrise on the lake. So we had a date. That stood up. It's so pretty. Surprisingly noisy. Like, I wonder how bad this is in ground boat. That's a chocolate croissant from Bao History. I think so. Oh. It looks fucking good wherever it is. Okay. We're getting surrounded by all these seagulls. They're all French. Or so they claim. Some of our French pastry that we're eating for breakfast. Oh my gosh, that's so beautiful. Wow. Dave, it's so beautiful. It looks better in the camera than it does in real life. <laughs> that lovely alarm punctuating our background. I know. My mom's birthday weekend and she usually loves like a chocolate milkshake so we went and got some ingredients for her and we're gonna make homemade milkshakes. So that's the whipped cream done. I'm gonna make some chocolate milk. So in addition to Jan's chocolate milkshake I also made Tabitha and I some Java chocolate chip milkshakes. Alright so here are the completed milkshakes. Chocolate shake with um, chocolate milk cocoa powder and then we've got Tabitha's Java ice cream with some chocolate syrup, caramel syrup, and cocoa powder, and then mine's just all the rest of it. Princess, go pick me up a surprise from the grocery store. <laughs> Colby loves bags. He loves bags. Now we're at the end of the day, and we're gonna drive 40 minutes out to another beach that's on like the opposite side so we can watch the sunset. So this will complete my day of sunrise, sunset, we are going to a new beach that we've never been to. So this is called Beverly Shores. It's part of the Indiana Dunes. And I think the, the beach we're going to is Camel Beach. Uh, so we're only two minutes away. That's the lake. This is where we're going to watch the sunset. We're going to have dinner. Oh yeah. Drink. We got our food. We stopped at this Mexican restaurant called Mucho Mas. And I think we got a wet burrito, and then Francisco got a horchata and some jarritos. Sitting over there. I'm gonna leave you here with Stephen. Our friend Stephen, I was really kind of around a lot. And then there's a wedding party right over there. And 
you shoving your face with a wet burrito like a classy lady. Steven, just patiently waiting. So you can barely see the Trigo skyline all the way over there. And we're, like we're not across like Michigan, we're still like very close to it. But it's crazy just that you can still see it. Let's put that food away, bro. Excuse me, sir, can I help you? Oh my God, he's coming. Perdón, señor. No tenemos comida para ti. I think, water looks cool nope. I think that's the Sears Tower right there. Really? Yeah. Okay, I'm moving around too much. Sorry. Apologies to Peter editing you. The sky looks so awesome. It somehow looks cooler in the video. Yeah. It's crazy. To go with our sunrise sunset. I got you mooning the moon. I got you mooning the moon.